Yes, we're at a team day today. It's August, we've had a lot of the season, it was nice to get everybody together. Been at the compound, we've had a few things going on as a team with all the riders done some timing. Hayden brought a little pink girls 16 inch bike, I think. And then we had the dad race, which was a right lap. Halfway down there to chug a beer, spin around five times, do five push ups, jump back on the bike and go. Just good team vibes, really. Alright, so uh, thanks for coming along. Um, mainly a fun day. Obviously, you guys can do some timing as well. Um, made some changes to track three. You're going to be the first guys to time it, and then that will then go live. All the leaderboards are now scratched, so you can time all three tracks today if you want, set a time. Obviously, we're going to have the dad race. There's a little surprise on that race, so any of you taking part in that one. Um, it's going to be on track one loki's which is the easier track oh we're off the track right yeah <laughs> there's no features at all you can even go around the little wall drop at the top so nice and easy you can get off and walk whatever you want to do we're also going to have a little mini bike race the little mini bikes hiding in the trees that's for everybody so anybody who wants to do that team rider or parent um or josh anyone who wants to stop cracking that and then there has been a fair amount of shit talked by a certain certain someone so Anyone who gets beat by Josh, you're off the team. <laughs> kind of a joke, kind of not. Bring None of you up, should boy. be in a position. Where we had we uh, Josh, our team mechanic, riding and doing some timing and uh, wound everybody up at the start and said if anyone gets beat by Josh, they're off the team. Um, thankfully, that <laughs> that didn't happen. Uh, Josh were well did some good times, but everybody managed to get in front of him, so that was good. Yeah. What's, uh, what's your job today, then? Small for these little pucks. They get smoked by a gravel riding, cross country riding, roll bike riding. Sent a card quite like. <laughs> And then we had the dad race, which was a right lap. And got the dads to race on track one, which is our easier track. Halfway down, they had to chug a beer, spin around five times, do five push-ups, jump back on the bike and go. But we set them off at 30 second intervals. So obviously we had two or three, four dads there at the same time. Uh, Jacob jumped in, uh, Theo's dad who didn't ride. So we had seven of them. So it was a good laugh. Um, Hayden's dad won. Uh, Sean Finn's dad was second and Seb. Stan Dwight was third, so yeah, it was good. It was good. really, really funny. Uh, good for good for us to watch watch those boys uh, race instead of the other way around for a change.
that will so you'll come over you'll come in this will slow you down tiny little bit and then you'll get on there and then you just need to lift the bike a little bit to stop the front end rock out yeah yeah exactly lift it. Yeah, good! Yeah, Josh! Yes, Josh! Yes, Josh. Yes. Woo! Oh, what the oh, fuck? I'm only cruising. Bro, so many oh, fucking divots there. Oh my god. What the fuck? Oh, you're Nasty! Oh <laughs> We called it Biggest Fanny Award because they won a fanny patch, um, and that was Ruben. Uh, didn't really turn up today. Everyone else did the Punisher line, so everyone's done the Punisher drop and the Punisher road gap. Ru's still not done that, which is a shame. So um, Ru won that. Um, and then we had the little bike race. So um, Hayden brought a little pink girl's 16 inch bike, I think. That race kind of didn't really happen. It was just everybody was going to set times throughout the day, but we got a front punk on the bike, so only a few of us rode it. But Josh Wood absolutely smashed that um, and just destroyed him, destroyed everyone. He beat me about 27 seconds or something. It was terrifying. We've had a really good time. Everyone's been out riding. Everyone's been present. It's been good. And uh, we now have the barbecue back at the house, just chilling and uh, just good team vibes, really. So, yeah, re really cool, really good day and lots of fun. And and obviously, my crash, everyone loved that. Uh, thankfully, it wasn't the first time I'd hit Punisher today. So, yeah, I'd done it twice. And then I give the lads a bit of chat about what to do. The lads that haven't done it, they then all did it. And then um, I did come down, wash the front out and barely slid down the landing. So, thankfully, I'm fine. But yeah, good times. Where are we going from? <laughs> Jaws and chicken, it's on fire. <laughs> hey, up. Gonna be timing here. Get out. Get out. But he interrupting a moment. I think it's coming towards the end of the season now, so I don't think I'll be back for any more of the races that end down. But just. Yeah, trying to recover and then try and get a good clean off season, lots of training, lots of gym work, a lot of bite time and just no injuries. So I can be nice and strong for the first race of the next season. Kinda of like kinda of getting to where we need to be by like this time. But like we're, to be fair, we're a little bit behind what I thought I'd be at by personally, but it's not the end of the world kind of thing because obviously I'm still improving so I'm getting faster quite quickly. It has been a bit up and down, but it's been in like a consistent sort of area, like on the leaderboard. So, yeah, no, it's been pretty good. Kind of the start of the season, it wasn't the best. I kind of was messing up a lot of my race runs, kept kind of crashing out, and had it kind of started going into the gym a bit more up my strength. And then uh, I had two races: the race at Revs, which just opened up and did well there, got first and fastest time of the day. And it kind of carried on that momentum to national champs and got third there, we had a really good run as well. So start off the season, few camps in Portugal, few races there. Um, the very start of the season, I did a race in Portugal and came third and that, I was really stoked about that. It sort of gradually got harder as the competition sort of came through in the season. Then we did some BDS races like Fort Bill, but I was about midway through my GCSEs then. So I really struggled in my head. It was quite difficult. Um, after my GCSEs, I sort of relaxed a bit. I got in the gym quite a lot and it's sort of been progressively getting a lot better. Um, but I'm definitely still working on my strength and fitness because I think that's the biggest thing holding me back at the moment. Overall, it's been pretty good. I've enjoyed it. So, well, so far anyway, but I've done yet. So I've got a few left, but I've enjoyed it so far and um, yeah, definitely just getting to see new places and enjoy around the bike everywhere. All right, so that's a wrap on the 2024 season. It has been something, that's for sure. So 
today I've got Ruben and Oscar over. We're gonna head out on the bikes. It's uh, it's gonna be wet today. It's gonna be muddy. We've got a new track, so <laughs> yeah. So we're gonna get wild. It's gonna be pretty loose, I reckon. Calling, calling for my head. You have to wait a little. 